Okay, let's look at some of the other things you can do with sounds. So one of the things I can do, um, I can, first of all, let's go down here and I can import a picture from my um, camera roll. So to do that, I'm just gonna do a slight swipe up from the bottom and there's my camera roll. I'm just gonna drag that and put it over here. And you can see I have all sorts of images or whatever I want to use. And then from there, I can drag this and put it, I, I just tapped it there. Actually, I don't have to drag it, I can just tap it. I've put it in twice, so let's just delete one of these. Um, let's see that, try that again, delete. Okay, now I want this out of the way, so I'm just gonna, with my finger, push that out of the way. And I've got this picture in here. Now, maybe what I'll do is I will rotate this picture so it's, up here, there we go. And again, I can scale this if I want. Okay, so there we go. Maybe I'll make it a bit smaller. Okay, so now what I'd like to do is I'm going to do a behavior for this picture. Um, oh, it's a bit slanted, let's keep it straight. There we go, that looks much better. So what I can do is I can click on behaviors. I'm going to add a new behavior. Um, let's have it, again, I like custom, but you can use the other ones. I'm gonna have it tap. So tap this item. When somebody taps this item, you can play a sound. Now there's all sorts of options for sound. So that automatically by default, that one's chosen, okay? Now audio clip, choose. So there are some audio clips in here, okay? So I do have audio clips that I could use. I can also import sounds. Now, where do these sounds come from? Okay, well, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go to voice memos, and this is where I'm gonna record my sound. So this is talking about the creative process. So let's just do a quick recording. The creative process is really important when we're creating something, obviously. Okay, so I'll stop there. Pretend that I'm done. I'm just gonna press done. Let's, I'm gonna label this, make it a little bit easier for me to, um, to find later on. This is the important part. So creative process, that's done, return. And now from here, I'm going to put, save this to files. Okay, I've got a voice memos folder there. If I didn't, I could always add another folder up there, but I'm gonna put it in voice memos. Okay, and save. Now, let's go back, let's quit voice memos, let's go back to Reality Composer, let's take this process again. So, uh, where am I getting this audio clip from? I'm going to choose the clip, import, there it is, creative process, because it was in my, it was on my iPad, there it was on my iPad, and I had voice memos, and creative process, there we go. So. Import, oh no, sorry, creative process, there we go. So it's done, so now I, oh, I haven't chosen it, sorry, try that again, one more time. Creative process, uh, it's there, so I gotta the check it again. The creative process is really there important. There we go, and now it says creative creating. process, so I can see it there. So now I can change the volume, so what's gonna happen is, somebody's going to tap this and they're gonna be able to hear. This is great for maybe explaining Maybe you've done a piece of, art, of artwork and you want to explain the, your thinking behind it or anything like that. So when somebody comes into the scene or when somebody sees the scene, they're going to be able to tap it and um, make it play. Now, how do they know to tap it? One of the things you could do, you could add, uh, let's do this. Let's just quickly create this box over here um, and let's make this box a little bit wider like this okay bring it over here and bring it i don't want it too big you can see here sometimes it's hard to see exactly where it is so i'm going to bring it like that and i'm going to bring it up there we go now let's see okay it's quite big let's uh, scale that down a bit and i could uh, let's change the color let's make it black and then i could um, add text, and there's my text, and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change that text to say, 
touch photo to hear my thinking. Okay, Let's change the spelling for me there. That's great. Thank you. Uh, that's done. And let's, we're gonna have to change the size a bit. Scale a bit down. Okay. Um, and again, I'm gonna, it be easier just to bring it along here. And so the, the plan for me is I wanna put that on there, right? So I've got this on here, font size. You can see, um, and I'm just gonna put that there, something like that. Maybe I'll actually, and then I can make this box a little bit, uh, is that width? There we go, there we go. So now I, I've got a little sign here, which I will fix just a bit here. Um, uh, there we go. You can see here that the text is not quite on, let's make it a little bit thicker. It's not quite on the, on my image there, so I'm just gonna push it back just a bit. And down a bit, there we go. Okay, so somebody, once they see this scene, they're gonna have a little prompt there for them to, to know what to do. So that's how to add audio.